Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt, and today it's time for another bourbon skirmish. What bourbons are going head to head today, you ask? Well, let me tell you. Recently, I was told that Evan Williams 1783 was the same thing as Elijah Craig Small Batch. Are these two the same or are they different? There's only one way to find out. And that's to put them in my, my body and analyze them. Let's get ready for this bourbon skirmish. Evan Williams, 1783. Heaven Hill Distillery. Small batch bourbon aged between six and eight years. 90 proof. <laughs> America is going in glass A. Elijah Craig small batch, 94 proof, Heaven Hill Distillery, bourbon aged between 8 and 12 years. America. Elijah Craig went in glass B. If you were to find these on a store shelf, typically Evan Williams 1783 is a sub $20 bottle, and Elijah Craig small batch is like mid 20s to mid 30s, roughly a $30 bottle. All right, let's put these on the wheel of confusion. And we spin, and we spin, and we spin, and we spin. There must be one close. Oh, found one. So the other one, the other one must be opposite. <sighs> Evan Williams, 1783. I was right. Elijah Craig small batch, sweet, caramel, oak, Evan Williams 1783 is extra dry nuttiness. Extra dry nuttiness, not as appealing, not as well-rounded, a bit abrasive and sharp on the nose. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Spinning it, spinning it to win it. Spinning it to win it. Spinning it to win it. Which way does it go? Who knows? Going the other way. Going the other way. Unspinning it. <gasps> Spinning it this way. Spinning it that way. Gotta find, oh, there's one right there. And right there. <sighs> Evan Williams, 1783. Nailed it, let's try it again. Oh, all right, here we go. Evan Williams, 1783. Three for three, eyes closed. They're not the same. These are not the same. The Elijah Craig is much sweeter, more balanced. I honestly don't have to taste them to tell you which one is better. The 1783 is a little bit stuffy. It has the extreme dry peanut shell nose on this one. The Elijah Craig doesn't have it. All right, before I determine a winner to this bourbon skirmish, I should at least taste them. So first things first, Elijah Craig small batch down the hatch. Hmm. Ooh, I like that. Might as well finish out this video with bottles and frame, right? Hmm. Hmm. Evan Williams, 1783. Yeah, a sweet up front, but then getting a little bit bitter towards the back, a little bit of nutty bitterness. The Evan Williams is obviously younger than the Elijah Craig, the Evan Williams has a lot of grain notes. There's a ton of corn coming through on here. The Evan Williams 1783 for under 20 bucks. Not a bad buy, not a bad buy. I would imagine a lot of people have this as their daily sipper, but it's not quite in the same league as the Elijah Craig small batch. The Elijah Craig is just aged longer, has a bit higher proof, 
and they probably select better barrels to blend into that batch. Is Evan Williams 1783 a quality bourbon? Yeah, it is. But it's not Elijah Craig small batch. They're different animals. I'm calling the stop to this bourbon skirmish at 30 seconds of round number one, determining the winner by 360 roundhouse kick to the face, Elijah Craig small batch. If you're out there watching this video and you have these two bottles, do me a favor, compare them for me and let me know. What do you think? Are these the same exact thing? I wasn't making this video to try to prove anybody wrong. I was actually making this video to see for myself and to see how close these were because I've never compared these two. I've never compared these two until right now, until right this second. My name is Matt, this is ADHD Whiskey, and like I always say, keep your head in the clouds, but your mind, I'm tuning in to Matt Madness, Friday nights, 10 p.m. live. This week, we have a crazy matchup. Dan and Sean from the Bourbon Junkies face off against each other and against Grease from the podcast. That's right, 10 p.m. Friday nights, Matt Madness Whiskey Tasting Invitational. It's a tournament of whiskey sipping, tasting, and fun.